Hey folks, in the previous video, we have learnt about various asset classes helping us to beat the inflation rate and to grow our wealth. I would recommend everybody to watch that video first because in that video we have discussed about these asset classes right from the scratch. In this video, we are going to discuss the appropriate allocation of the resources in these various asset classes. Legend has it, never put all your eggs in the same basket. The percentage of allocation of resources is affected by various factors such as age, dependency, income and many others, which we will discuss in the upcoming sessions. The discussed allocation in this video is as per the age group from 25 to 40 years. To start off with, Cash Asset Class As we all know, this is a most liquid form of asset class, generally used as a contingency fund or used for short term requirements. In this asset class, we should at least invest 6 monthly incomes for quick transactions, emergencies and short term requirements. Example, a working professional loses his job, in that case, this asset class will help him to manage the finances till a new job is found. Due to ample liquidity, no necessities will be sacrificed and will act as an emergency fund. Coming to the second one, Fixed Income Asset Class. In this asset class, as we know, a certain percentage of return is going to be fed. It is a bit safer investment. In this case, we should invest 10 to 15 percentage of the capital because of the safety of principal and to offset the inflation rate to an extent. Now, coming to Commodities Asset Class. Gold acts as a hedge against inflation and empirically, gold has a tendency to perform when equity markets don't perform. So we should have an ample amount of investment in gold of around 20 to 25 percentage in this asset class. During economic downturn, gold has a tendency to outperform. As observed during the COVID crisis, Nifty crashed from 12,000 all the way till 7,500. At the same time, gold's prices appreciated from 30,000 to 55,000. Also, it may protect us from unwanted surprises of the equity markets. Coming to the last asset class, which is equity asset class. This asset class has the most potential to outperform the other asset classes. So to grow our wealth exponentially, majority of the funds should be invested in asset class with equity exposure. So 55 to 60 percentage of the total capital should be invested in this asset class. Great power comes with great responsibilities. Now we understood allocation of resources in these asset classes, but another important factor attached to investments is risk. In the next video, we will understand about the risks involved in investments. Thank you so much for staying tuned up till here. If you have liked the video, do hit the like button, do share it amongst your friends and do hit the subscribe button so that the learning content reaches you first. Thank you.